What's good, YouTube man? It's your boy Young Dub man. Coming at y'all with update number 87,000, it feels like. But um, no, no, seriousness, man. We got some more, um, some more car audio equipment in. Uh, this came in. This just came in from UPS today. Um, I know I ordered it, but maybe I don't know. I, I forgot about it and just wasn't expecting it to come in. So uh, UPS just dropped this joint off, and I. I'm kind of torn on the on the decision right now, but I did buy this for my PRV, um, the PRV horn. So um, y'all know we've been rolling for the past couple of days, man. So let's just go ahead and get this Joker open and unbox it. Um, already cut the top off just to make it easier for the video, but let me get this Joker up out of here, man. And look at that, pulled it out the correct way, man. You can't get no better than that. So here is something that i don't know people may or may not be uh shocked to see uh this is a dual um two channel amplifier class d uh 600 watts of course that's, that's i don't even know if that's max i would just call that that's just crap marketing and stuff but whatever but the rest of the amp is the truth man this thing um i think it's 59 or 60 dollars at walmart um of course me knowing that um, I did do a, um, uh, I did do my research, my due diligence as far as trying to research things. Uh, y'all know this, if y'all, you know, car audio like y'all should be on my channel, um, this was featured on Budget Gym or Budget, uh, Bus. Ryan Blankenship did do a, uh, amp dyno of it. Uh, so he tried it out and seen, you know, crazy, he's seen crazy numbers from it. So, uh, the power is legit when it comes down here to the CA, uh, certification. So, um, Let's get her open and just moving another step forward in my car audio build, which is obviously at this point everybody knows to be uh, pretty bonkers. Uh, I guess we'll do some, try to get the box on there, see if that'll. It's got the, um, well, base boost, we don't mess with that, but um, bridgeable operation, two ohm stable. Uh, obviously, if you know you're going to bridge it, uh, do it at four ohms, but. Uh, we know it did put out uh, 240 watts RMS at 4 ohms uh, based on a test for a uh, budget gym or budget bus, man. But um, let me say forget the box and open her up. When you open her, you get a box inside of a box, which is at this point is just normal. Uh, let me cut her open here. Uh, hope I didn't go too deep. You know what? Screw it. I'm going to just take it out. I'll do it off camera. I don't want to be messing around dropping stuff like I did uh, with my, or not Scar, but with my uh, Orion Super Tweeters. All right, just a second here. All right, so I think I'll leave that tape on there. We'll just slide her out. All right, so y'all see how she came packed. Uh, she does come in some styrofoam packaging, a um, little baggy there, um, just the bounty heart, okay, good looking duo, man, they came with some amp grommets in there, man, so that's what's up, uh, you got your Allen key and your mounting hardware, but this joker did come with some grommets in there, man, that, for this to be a little cheapo, El Cheapo amplifier, man, she, she's doing her thing, man, I like that. She's rated nicely and um, came with two manuals. Uh, installation in your owner's manuals. Come with the Spanish one and uh, the English one. Yeah, y'all do know uh, there is a four channel version of this amp that's uh, equally bonkers. Uh, she does crazy power as well. But let's get the amp open. It is small, man. That's what's up. Look how tiny that thing is, man. She is super small, man. I like that. Let's see. That's what's up, man. <laughs> this thing is tiny, man. That is, this thing is tiny, man. That's crazy. I, I like it, though. Hey, it might be cheap, but I think it's nice, man. It's an El Cheapo amplifier, but I think it's nice, man. It's, it's tiny as ever. Uh, but like I said, y'all know it does put out the great power. Uh, looks like mine here was manufactured in September 2018. Uh, they okay, that's nice. So they do 
Now, for anybody that may or may not know uh, how to hook the amp up, it does give you some um, pictures on there and some, um, you know, some little ideas of how to do either two speakers, two subs, or maybe one sub in order to get that installed, man. But yeah, this thing, she's, she's an itty bitty thing, man. She's tiny, but she, I like it, man. I like, I really like the design on it. So there's your uh, power inputs. Uh, I can promise y'all it's four gauge terminals. Um, like I said, if, if you don't know about this amp, go over to Budget Gym or Budget Bus and check it out. Uh, comes fused with the 25 amp fuse and um, roughly 10 gauge uh, speaker terminals. Um, everything is angled here, uh, but I'm not tripping about that. Like I said, it's, it's gonna do its power. I'll figure out where to put her in. Uh, she does have line in and line out um, RCA inputs or hookups, I guess I should say. I don't like these things, um, even though I know they're just there for the protection, but um, they're not Tiffany style RCAs, uh, but what can you expect for $69, or $59? Uh, like I said, y'all know it, it's, it might be $59 at Walmart. Uh, I am the eBay king, so of course I paid 40, I think $48 for this thing, $47. Uh, but like I said, just based on uh, what we've seen at Budget Gym, Budget Bus, uh, the amp does do power. Uh, I know what my PRV horns require. Uh, as far as what they need for power so i'm definitely going to go that route uh, in order to get those installed and looking good so uh, we'll go from there uh, like i said it's just another update on the channel uh, stay tuned uh, there is tons more to come like i said i don't know right, right there there's boxes right there i think no that's the piece on here there's boxes back there there's a little piece uh, on top of those boxes i uh, still haven't unboxed those yet I got a ton of little knickknack items uh, laying around that I haven't unboxed yet. So uh, just stay tuned to the channel, man. There's going to be tons more to come, man. So um, we got our first amp for the highs, the mids and highs portion of the build here. So uh, yeah, I know we got the Orion 3K uh, SPLX amp. Uh, we finally got this. It's just, like I said, a little dual amp. Uh, but she, we know she does hella power, hella rated. So uh, good to go there. And uh, we got some more coming. So uh, stay tuned, man. There'll be a lot more updates. Um, we got giveaways going. Uh, we got the Crescendo video where you should drop your numbers. Just to reiterate, on the Crescendo PWX video, when I unbox those, that's where you drop your number from 1 to 700, man. So just reiterate that. Make sure y'all dropping it on that video. Uh, Friday, we'll do the giveaway, and we'll get things shipped out. And this weekend, I want to do another giveaway. So... Stay tuned to the channel. Uh, make sure y'all subscribe and share the videos, and we'll go from there. Uh, as ever, as always, it's your boy on Dub. Uh, comment, like, whatever, anything, your thoughts. I try to get back to everybody, man. So make sure y'all hopping on the videos and sharing them. I do appreciate everybody that's been around here. Uh, so we'll do more things to make sure we get the channel to grow, man. It's your boy on Dub. I'm out.